Kaaba's place in the Holy Mosque is unique and the structure is covered with honorable, revered verses from the Quran, which are engraved on its black cover, the Qaswa. Ever since the two prophets Ibrahim and Ismail built the Kaaba, it has become a center of attention and its Qaswa throughout ages has been made from the most luxurious quality of material available. The first to have given the Kaaba a complete Qaswa was King Tubba. When the people wanted to get rid of that king, they advised him to demolish the Kaaba. So he prepared the army and decided to head to Mecca to demolish the Kaaba, but he fell gravely sick. When he was cured from his illness, he decided to reward Mecca and its people. Prophet Muhammad and his Khalifs, as well as all Muslim rulers, gave a lot of care to the Qaswa, which became one of the most distinguishing characteristics of the Grand Mosque and the Kaaba at its center. The importance of the Kiswa can be seen in the way it was brought from places far away from Mecca and the way the procession carrying it was venerated. It was also clear how key Muslims were to serve the two holy mosques. In 1927, Saudi King Abdul Aziz ordered the establishment of a factory dedicated to manufacturing the Kiswa in Mecca. This factory has witnessed a series of upgrades in order for the Qaswa to be of the best quality and shape. The accessories were made of gold-plated silver wires. Modern sewing machines have been imported for the purpose. Probably they are unprecedented in the world. These machines are now found in the Qiswa factory. The total annual cost of one Qiswa is estimated at 20 to 22 million Saudi riyals. The Kiswa weighs approximately 670 kilograms and is made of pure silk dyed in black and padded with white cotton fabric. The Kiswa is embroidered in Quranic verses, all made with threads of pure gold. <laughs>